Uh, so Greta asked the question. Greta's coming with the fire, dude. She, she is. is on it. Uh, she said, what is the most difficult habit that you have worked with an athlete to break? Come at me. What you got, Mike? Man, like I, I, I tell you, after binge listening nutrition podcasts on Friday uh, while driving, I'll say – I'm, they said, and they were all like nutrition coaches. They all said nutrition because it people treat it like a religion for some reason. But I will say something different. Yep. Sleep. Oh, here we go. You're going to get Mike riled up, Greta. <laughs> uh, yeah. Like getting athletes to, to quit watching that show that's on, you know, at 1030 getting athletes to wind down, to put down the screen, to to improve their sleep hygiene, to get up at the same time every day, even on weekends. Like that's hard stuff. 30 seconds. Get people to do. Go. That was easy. <laughs> that's, that's a solid one. Uh, mine is comparison. Mine is, is an athlete looking at another athlete's arbitrary data on Strava that doesn't even really relate to them whatsoever and going, well, why am I not doing that? Or why am I not recovering so fast? So I think comparison to me is one of the biggest ones that I've worked with an athlete or athletes to help break because, you know, at the end of the day, like we were talking about earlier, like you're unique, your nutrition strategy is different. Your goals are different. Your, your base of fitness is different. You've been in the sport two years. They've been in the sport 22 years, you know, so how can you effectively compare them side by side? So comparison, because I believe it leads to anxiety. It leads to frustration, at least all these other things that then kind of snowball down the hill. So for me, the most difficult habit is because it's so easy to do with social media, whether it's Facebook, thank God for Facebook tonight, or we couldn't reach all these people, but Strava or, you know, anywhere people are looking to go, well, they're doing that. Why am I not faster? You know, it's just, it's just understanding that you belong in the moment you're in. And make the most of that moment and move on because they made the most of that moment. People you're looking at, they made the most of that moment that they had. I like that answer. 